Hi guys, my name is Gloria with Lakeland, Florida. If you're planning to towing a trailer with your Chevy Trax, you will need a trailer wiring harness installed. It's required by law. So let's show you how it's done. You will need these tools seen here to complete this installation. This trailer wiring harness will be installed on the back of the tail light on both sides. Remove the floor panel. Remove your phone padding with a T40 torque bit. Let's repeat on the passenger side. Next, we're gonna remove the cargo hooks on both sides. We're gonna use a 10 millimeter socket. Next, remove the panel. Next, we're gonna remove the cargo covers by removing the fastener here and here. Next, remove the Phillips screw here and here. Next, we're going to remove this door right here. With the door removed, you're going to see the tail light connector. Next, we're going to remove the cargo door on the passenger side. Next, we're going to remove the door right here with the flathead screwdriver. With the door removed, now you can see the tail light connector. Next, we're gonna take our connector with the yellow and brown wire. We're gonna feed it underneath and you wanna pull it. Next, we're gonna remove the connector from the tail light. Next, we're gonna connect the T connector. Next, we're gonna repeat the same step with the red and green connector on the passenger side. Next, we're gonna go ahead and ground it. Now we're gonna connect our exclusive U-Haul power wiring to our battery. Now we're gonna remove this nut right here with a 12 millimeter socket. Now we will connect the fuse holder. Now we're gonna bring our wire down behind the brake line. Now that we have our power cable down on the bottom of the vehicle, we're gonna fish wire through the frame of the vehicle. Now that we have our power wire connected to the fish wire, we're gonna go ahead and pull it through the frame. Now we're gonna go ahead and go over this plastic guard right here. Now we're gonna go through the brake cable over the rear axle.
Now we're gonna bring up the power wire through this grommet. Now we're gonna connect the battery wire. Next, I'm going to show you how to store your four-way flat. You can either leave it inside the cargo area or you can run it underneath the vehicle. Let's show you how it's done underneath the vehicle. We're going to run it through the same grommet that we used to pull the battery power cable. Now that we have our four-way flat underneath the vehicle, we're going to go ahead and mount it with this bracket. This bracket does not come with a kit. You can get it at your closest U-Haul center or uhaul.com. Now that our bracket is mounted, we're gonna go ahead and put our four-way flat through it. You can place the cover if you like. Now we're going to cut the grommet. Now that we're done on the cargo area, we're going to go ahead and put everything back together. Now that everything is done, we're going to take our 15 amp fuse that's provided and we're going to go ahead and place it in place right here. Now we're going to go ahead and clean everything up. Thank you again for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Go ahead, go outside, have fun, and thank you again. If you have any questions about the products seen in this video, or if you'd like to schedule an installation with a U-Haul Hitch professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.